What's up, DC Breeze fans? I'm Parker Jensen. Joining me today is the head coach of the DC Breeze, Daryl Stanley. Now, Daryl, just kind of getting into it, we just finished a, a tryout. So, how do you think the class is going so far? How do you see this improve? Is uh, is it an improvement from other classes? What do you think of this tryout so far? Yeah, so it's my third uh, tryout. And yeah, I, I think this group this year was like a lot deeper. We had about 65, 67 open signups, and that just turned into like 30 people even to this last tryout for about 14 spots. That's a really good thing. I think that uh, the DC community has really come out and we've just seen a new influx of talent to show up. Um, some from high school, uh, local colleges, and a lot of clubs. So, very exciting. Some of the returning guys came on to the field today for tryouts. How is that returning class helping out these group of uh, people who are trying out today? For me, I like to delegate a lot. And one of the things that I love about the players that are returners is they do a great job. Um, you know, so they'll give as much instruction or maybe more than even I would on an individual basis. And I think with those returners, it makes that number not be, you know, 35 athletes to one coach. It turns it more into like a seven players to one leader. Well, kind of building off that too, something that surprised me walking into it was the uh, environment of the trials. Everyone just kind of loose, relaxed. Um, do you think that kind of helps with the team? Is that kind of characteristic uh, of the team as well? Yeah, I think so. I mean, for us, it's the third tryout. So, um, you know, these players have mostly gone through and played each way. Um, you know, we try to make sure they're in those groups of seven and we hold them to those groups of seven so that there's at least chemistry while they're playing. I think the community already, we, we see each other in other avenues and other versions of the sport. Uh, other outlets and that helps but just the community in general and our spirit I think makes it such that we're uh, a more collective bunch than we are fully competitive um, so even when we're trying to win and even when we're trying to show our best I think you still see the, the spirit of the game shine through and the camaraderie of our 